Hi, I'm Craig Taylor. I'm putting together this very, very quick screencast as a result of attending the recent Usizer Using Social Media for Training event that I facilitated at last week. My particular session was around using YouTube for training and the day before the event, when I was traveling up to Manchester on the train, I was reading the excellent, excellent Social Media for Trainers by Jane Bozarth. And in there, she gave a really, really good tip on how to edit the URL within a YouTube video to allow you to be able to start a specific point in the video. So imagine you found a video online, maybe it's 15 or 20 minutes long, but the actual section that you want to direct your learners to may be 10, 15, 16 minutes into the actual video itself. So what a great idea to actually be able to save the learner a lot of time, prevent the learner from being off-putted, um, as to having to view that much potentially irrelevant content, and actually be able to signpost them and take them straight to the content that you actually want them to view. So let's have a look how you actually do this then. I've got down here a very, very brief video. It's only two minutes and 40 seconds, or two minutes and four seconds long. So not a very long video. Video, but needless to say it does I think it does still illustrate the point what the first thing I do is go to the URL click at the end of the URL and then enter a hashtag then what I need to do is type T for time the equal symbol 1m standing for 1 minute 20s 1 minute 20 seconds and that's the point I want to take the learner to when they launch this video of course that time scale could be anything it could be anything from a few seconds to several minutes to handfuls of minutes what you do need to do though is take the hashtag T for time equals 1 M 1 minute 20 seconds or whatever time setting you want it to do and just to show you that this works what I'm going to do is I'm going to copy that URL I'm going to paste it into a new browser window and what you will find is that when this video launches it will go straight to the 1 minute 20 second point in the video just like this and there you can see I've just let it run for a few seconds there but as you can see we're already at 1 minute 24 and I set it to start at 1 minute 20 so a really nice neat little way of being able to take your learners into a YouTube video at the specific point you want them to concentrate on and not anything that's irrelevant or erroneous beforehand hope you found this useful